Hey, what's up, everybody? Monica Barnes from Monica Barnes Art here. I am actually doing a bullseye pour on this board. I am using East Coast epoxy resin. I used uh, three ounces of the resin and three ounces of the hardener. I am stirring together for three minutes. I am just going to use two simple colors on this board white and blue that's it that's all i'm using the colors are seaside blue from the color cottage and white shimmer so i put a little bit of the powder into my cup and now i'm going to pour the resin in them this is a very quick and easy painting for anybody to do and it's fun. Okay, so all my colors are mixed up really good and I'm just gonna start pouring the white and the blue one after another until they're all gone. Oh, I forgot to tell you, um, this is a 12 by 12 canvas that I did spray paint with teal color and that's it. And now I'm just pouring the colors on. When I'm done, I'm going to move it around and see what we get. This is by far the easiest thing to do. Anybody could do this. Okay, so right now I am using the heat gun to heat up the resin so it moves around a little bit better and it does pop all those little bubbles. You wanna pop those bubbles because you don't want them in there for your final piece. Okay, so now I'm just moving it around and you can capture a glimpse of how that mica shimmers in the light. It's so pretty. I stretched it a little bit too far, so I'm gonna add a little bit more color to it so it pops a little bit more. So right now I'm just following the lines that are already there and I'm just enhancing them with the colors that I have. always just use the resin that has spilled over the edges to do my sides because I don't know when I sell a piece of art I don't know if the person's going to frame it and if they decide not to frame it I want my edges done and my sides done really well I scrape um, the drips off with my tongue depressor also and I will recheck those drips 
in like 15, 20 minutes. Okay, so this is my final pass with my heat gun to make sure I popped all those bubbles. And I'm gonna bring the camera down so you guys can see what I made. If you liked my video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. Thanks for watching, everybody.